today. From Mercedes-Benz Stadium in Atlanta, Georgia. This is the National Football League. Bridgewater and the Carolina Panthers. First opened in 2017. There's a look at the beautiful state-of-the-art Mercedes-Benz Stadium here in Atlanta, GA. A moment ago, here was the scene. The Falcons coming out from their tunnel to the roar of all the folks here in Atlanta. We're ready for football as these Falcons get set to match up with the Carolina Panthers. taken about a yard deep and the tackle going to be made right there at the 25 yard line matt ryan the longtime falcon a veteran who's been in the league since 08 ready to guide this atlanta offense this past offseason was one where the atlanta organization continued to build around their quarterback matt ryan because he can still throw the rock fifth in the nfl in passing yards last year with better than 4400 He's a guy who knows how to get the ball to his guys on the perimeter and take care of it, even when he's under duress in the pocket. Sacked 48 times last year. Throwing now, Ryan on first down. Going to flare this one out to Gurley in the flat. Great from the 32-yard line here, second and three. Now this one complete downfield on the left side. And able to rip off a big chunk of yardage before being dropped in. To throw again is Ryan. And Jones has it over the middle. And they're going to have another. On third down, Ryan. It's caught. Jones. And able to get him down, but he does reach the five. They're able to convert. They're going on fourth down. It's Ryan. And will be taken in by Ridley for a Falcon touchdown. A one-yard touchdown pass. And the Falcons. I trust my defense as well. They don't get it. I know you're going to hold them. So it's a message to your entire team that you believe in them. It's good, and that gives the Falcons a 7 to nothing lead. A pretty long yard line as he's dropped at the 23. Now leading out the Panthers' offense, a new man in charge for 2020, a member of the Saints the last couple of years. It's Teddy Bridgewater. What an audition last year for Teddy Bridgewater in New Orleans. Not one that he expected to have happen with the injury to Drew Brees, but he stepped into the breach, and the Saints went 5-0 in his start, and he showed the rest of the league he was ready to be a starting quarterback again now he gets his opportunity with a brand new head coach a brand new organization in Carolina Bridgewater gonna lead the Panthers up here first and 10 at their own 23 first carry for Mike Davis the former Seahawk and he'll take it forward for about five up. from the shotgun it's Bridgewater this one caught by Davis. And he's able to get the first before he's taken. Davis will try to run for it. And that one going nowhere from the start as he's met in the backfield and goes backwards. That'll back him up two yards. Just swing it out to your runner. Get him out in the flat and let him have a chance to make people miss an open field. Ryan able to get this to Gurley. And they get him down but not the 
before he takes it across the 40-yard line. 12 more yards for from the shotgun, Ryan. This one finding the hands of Brandon Powell. And they're going to have another first down as the tackle's made at the Panthers' 22-yard line. And this would be, if they can get the stop here, third and goal. They'll try and pick up the first with Gurley. And he will take it in for a Falcon touchdown. A three-yard touchdown run. And the Falcons push for... Good to make it 14-0. So that one a long 11-play drive. And it's finished off by a Todd Gurley touch. See them open things up, because otherwise this defense is going to gang up on the run and set them down. Open man is Anderson. And he slips up past the 45 before being tacked. And that may open some things up for you offensively. On third down, Bridgewater. And that's going to be good for another first down as the tackle's made at the Falcons' 18. The can drive this one tough. They need nine yards on third down. Completes it to Samuel. And able to get... They'll try to punch it in with Davis. And, and his completion. And that makes this second and nine. To throw is Ryan. It's caught over the middle by Hurst. And they're going to have... Again, Ryan. A very quick pass to Ridley. From Orlando with our halftime report. But business to take care of before we get there. A two. And he'll take it into the end zone. Touchdown, Atlanta. Matt Ryan able to connect with his... Action. And it's 21-3. to three. A good drive that time as they go nine plays in all. And the Falcons score to cap it off. Panthers three. Sterling. The Panthers going to get the football first. Trailing here as well as we resume play in this second half. Cooper on the return. And he brings us out past the 20 to the 24. The Panthers take over first and 10 at their own 24-yard line. Out come the Panthers. They'll have it first on offense in the third quarter. Now they had compiled a pretty long drive last time. Unfortunately, though, it ended with no points after the missed field goal. And that can hurt the psyche of a team because as they drove downfield, you know you're never supposed to count points in your mind until they go up on the board. But let's face it, we've been there. We've seen teams before. They were counting on those points. They didn't get them. Can they come back now, start over again, and grind it out? Bridgewater and the Panthers going to come up here first and 10 at their own 24. Second half starts with a run by Davis. Desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. He'll have a first down past the 40. And he's got it across the 50 to the 47-yard line. A gain of 26. Gain here is the 37 on third down. From the gun, Bridgewater. Oh, he got position on him, and he pulls it in. Offense. A couple extra tight ends are in. Third and goal from the one. A first carry for Trenton Canna. A sly on now for the Panthers. From the right hash, and this one just a chippy. And his kick is play on the completion. Got him half of what they needed. Now here's a tough third and five. <laughs> Throwing his Bridgewater. And they haven't done anything so far here in the second half. On third down, Ryan. And this time he's got the hookup. It's complete. from the gun, Ryan, and this is caught for a Falcon touchdown, Russell Gage there to make the grab, and the Falcons will extend their lead, that drive that really increased, he's got it and the lead swells, it's 28 to 6, a pretty long drive that time, 11 plays all told, and this is third and seven, 
On play action, it's Bridgewater. Taking a shot for Samuel. And... On second and 12, Ryan. And he will find Ridley, that's complete. First and goal, it's first and 10 from the 10. On first down, Ryan. And he is into the end zone for a Falcon touchdown. Connecting backfield. That's exactly what happened there. And he got into the end zone. And he's been a busy man. Five for five now as he knocks another one through to extend the lead. That time a six play. Here's Bridgewater. Flushed out right. And he'll be taken down. He should got him seven. Now here's third and three. Bridgewater again. And that is it on six of their eight tries. Very good. This will be third and five. They go play action now. Ryan. And take this will be third and six. Operating from the gun. Ryan. A slant to Jones. They run out of the shotgun with Gurley. And he will maneuver his way down to about the seven. Only a yard there, and that'll bring us to third and goal. Partner, I know we're in a goal-to-go situation, but my goodness, think about running the ball here, not even a thought, is yeah, it? defensively, they're in a prime spot. And I think the defensive guys are probably expressing themselves to them as well. I wouldn't run it here, guys. You might want to try throwing it. So time runs out. It's a victory for the Atlanta Falcons. And you look back over the score sheet, interesting. A very clean game. No turnovers by either side. An absolute rarity when we watch games now because defenses have put such an emphasis on taking the ball away. Well, what we saw here was offenses spending their time saying, look, you know they're coming for it. Ball security is paramount. So they worked on that, not just a week of practice, but I'm sure all during training camp. Make sure when you have it, tuck it away because danger lurks everywhere you turn. for Charles Davis and all our hardworking crew. I'm Brandon Gawden. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, find us on Twitter at EA Madden NFL. It's a win for the Falcons here as we say so long from Atlanta.